sure I saw a level 40 alpha around here, so. Was that a plesiosaur? sore? Is that another? Yeah, that's a plesiosaur sore right there. Ooh, is that an alpha right there? Oh yeah, there's gotta be one right on the right side. Yeah, there it is right there, the level 45 male. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh my god, please sore piece of trash. So, oh man! So we have a plesiosaur. We have a few regular Tusatuthas here. My guy is set to aggressive mode, so that's why he's just kind of attacking every anything and everything here, you guys. I guess we have to fight everything here. Maybe, hopefully the alpha will survive and we can actually see if we can tame him, but let's kill these other regular Tusatuthas real quick. Man, we got snatched by a regular one. And we killed him, that's good. That's easy peasy, no problem, mo. I can barely see through all the ink going on right now, but I think I might be attacking the alpha. Uh, looks like it just killed a regular alpha right- or a uh, regular Tusatuthas right there. Oh, I've been sna- Oh my god, it's taming time! It's time to tame! Man, we have a hundred, uh, black pearls right now. Do we have enough? <laughs> Feed black pearls. Oh my god, 89%. Holy heck. 89%. Only needs to give him one more. Only need to give him one more. Let me set him one to neutral. Or a passive. Passive, passive. So it looks like my guy is not going to attack and break any of that tame bonus. Oh, come on, come on. Wait until it's hungry again. No! I cannot wait until it's hungry again. No, I have no stamina because of the heck and, uh, ink. No! Okay, I'm going to set him one to neutral. Set him one to neutral just in case anything funny happens, you guys. There's the alpha again. He's right here. I don't think he has anything. He's, oh my god, yep. That's level 45. I need to get on some. I need to get on my Mosasaurus. I need to get on someone because I have no stamina right now. I cannot move. Man. Oh man, that one's almost dead. Holy heck. Let's kill that one. Let's kill that one. Just so it's kind of... Oh no. I think I've been snatched. I think I've been snatched. Oh, okay. I got snatched by a regular one. And I killed it pretty easily right there. Not bragging. I need to get on my... My Mosasaurus has been snatched. Come on. We have like no... Which one's which? I can't tell. Okay, my mo- Oh man, I can't even see. <laughs> oh, there's ink everywhere. Come on, Mosasaurus. Come here, come here, come here. I need to get on you so I have some stamina. Stamina got drained from all the ink. Whew, there we go. Now hopefully my- Yes, my stamina's going up. Sheesh. Man. Whew, I'm going to need to set him to follow me here in a moment though, you guys. Just to make sure. There we go. Looks like my stamina's fine. Let me set him to follow me. Boom, there we go. Oh wait, hold on, yeah. Let me- Let me hopefully get the alpha to aggro on us. There he is right there, and hopefully grab us with his tent. There we go. There we go. He's got my Mosasaurus again. Let's try and get between these tentacles. Go up to that beak. Still at like 80-something percent tamed. Wait, wait until it's hungry again. What? Okay. Um, oh my god, my Alpha Tusa Toothus has like 40 levels right there. Sheesh. I don't know how long it's going to take until this one needs food, you guys. I don't want my Mos- I'm like, he has like 90,000. He has like double the health of this guy. I'm not bragging or anything. But, I don't know how much longer I need to wait or- Oh my god, there's my Mosasaurus right there. I don't know how much longer I need to wait for him to- There we go, we got snatched again. Until we can hopefully tame this guy, cause it's been like a good 2-3 minutes since we just fed him that 50 right there. Wait until he's hungry again, oh my god, come on! Come on, we need to tame him right now! One eternity later. Okay, here's the alpha. Hopefully we're gonna get him. Come on, snatch us up! Snatch me up, Ada! There we go, okay, we got snatched up. Hopefully we're gonna get him this time. Oh my god, come on! And... Oh yes! Finally! Oh my god! I don't know how long I've been recording the last little bit while I was trying to tame this level 45, but man, we finally got him, it looks like. Oh, here's that regular one right here. Level 95. Let's melee him down. Boom, got him. Alright, well, let's get on our Mosasaurus. Now we have two Alpha Tusa to do this tame right now, you guys. Pretty decent level between all of them, honestly. Yeah, I'm kind of glad I didn't like, get a little bit too greedy when it comes to levels, being like, mm, I snub my nose at anything under level 100. I'm kind of glad I tamed the level 20, or level, what was it, 15? And then the level 45? Level 45 was hard as heck, and I'm not saying, like, oh, I almost died a few times, because I'm like, I probably got pretty close there a few times, but I'm probably going to cut out a million years worth of dead footage. <laughs> but the level 15 was able to get tamed with only 50 black pearls. The level 45 with, well, honestly, 100 black pearls, but he was at, like, 89% after 50, so... We probably could have tamed him, like, if we could tame him with increments of 25, I'm pretty sure we would have been able to tame him with only 75 black pearls, but it's 50 black pearls per taming attempt, so that's kind of cool either way. Let's see how much health the, uh, I guess just check the stats in general of all of them, so let me see, level 67 on that one, and he has, uh, 78,000 health, oh my god, and of course these guys do have an AoE attack, and I do not have a Tusa Toothus saddle right now, so, oh my god, this guy has 40 levels, yeah, I saw that earlier, sheesh. I guess we can give him some more health or something like that. Sheesh. Might want to give him some more uh, melee damage. Let's get that up. Uh, I think maybe because he killed a few Tooth Toothus. And of course, those guys give you so many levels. Let's give this guy 100,000 health. Oh my god. <laughs> Let me give him the rest. 
on uh, melee damage. Boom. Oh, wait. I got a little bit too far away from him. Oh, my God. He's, he has so much extra health now. He looks like he's almost dead with all the blood around him. Sheesh. <laughs> One more level up on melee damage, and he should be good to go. Kind of want to level up my... Uh, two, oh, what oh, yeah. I just said he leveled up right there. I thought he died. Oh, yeah. And they do passively produce oil, which is good. I guess I can keep him next to my Bazillus horses and... Uh, or just one bazil source and be able to get a bunch of uh, passive production of oil, which is always good. And I have a bunch of raw meat right here and carrot and I do not need, so let's get rid of that. And oh my god, the guy's health went up by like 6,000 per level up. Holy heck and heck. Man, I need to head home right now, you guys. I really... Well, first of all, to our nearest base, which of course is our old base. <laughs> but let's head back that way. And then let's go home. Let's go make an... Uh, we might be able to make an alpha to the saddle. But I kind of want to just get a regular one. And I don't know if I ever said this on camera. Maybe I did. But Tusa Toothis are the best at killing Nidaria. Because, of course, Nidaria seem like they hang out in packs of, like, I don't know, three, four, five of them. We don't need to try and, like, swim around them and hit them, like, once at, one at a time. These guys do have an area of effect and damage, meaning, like, they swipe their tentacles and they're able to attack anything and everything that's in the way. They're able to do one attack, but anything that's in the way of that attack, you know, multiple critters, they're all going to take damage. So if we do one swipe against a bunch of Nidarias, like a big pack of Nidarias, uh, oh, I think I went a little bit. Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, I went a little bit. Whoa! I didn't even notice that, probably because we were underwater, but the level 65, well, I guess level 69 now, is uh, red. I didn't notice that. I thought he was black because he was underwater and stuff, you know? Oh, Megalodon right there. What a piece of garbage. But, but our level 15 that we tamed, seems like he's black and gray right there. So I guess leave comments down below. What should we name the red? Uh, are they both male? Or is it male, female? Or what's going on right now? I don't know, but I do want to switch back to my... There we go. And I do have a level up for myself. Let's go up to 390 health right there. That one's a male. And I think I might be able to see from Super Spawn Loss. What level is the level 65? Okay, yep, they're both male. Level 69 and level 65, they're both male. So, male level 65 is the gray and black one, and the male level 69 is the red and what looks like maybe just red and black right there. So that is really cool. Leave comments down below naming those fellas, and be sure to like comments down below. If you guys think of really good name suggestions or tips or anything like that, that way I know which ones are very popular amongst you guys. Anyways... We are pretty close to home. Yep, you can see my phoenix right there. That's what I'm talking about. Seems like these guys, like, speed-wise? Seems like they might be able to keep up with me, like, decently. I'm like, he does have 120% movement speed, so maybe if I get these guys a little bit more movement speed, they'll be able to move about as fast as me. So, honestly, not too sour about them. Uh, previous two of I've had on the center, of course, they were just regular ones. They were not alphas. They were really slow critters. So let me set up one to unfollow. There we go. They were really, really slow critters, you guys. So I basically didn't even use them. But uh, these alphas over here, I'm like, they do have a lot of health. They have a lot of, probably a lot of melee damage, especially with the AoE attacks. And of course, it seems like they're decently fast. So we might be fine. Anyways, let me get the oil off of everyone. The squid oil, uh, even Bazillosaurus oil right there as well. Not bad. Um, blue or uh, black pearls. I might be able to keep that on my Mosasaurus and everyone. Don't really matter too much. And I think I got a comment from someone saying, hey, stop using your Phoenix to fly all over the map. Of course, your uh, Alpha Tyrannon is a little bit faster than your Phoenix, and he's actually able to land on the ground. So, yeah, I, I think I might try and get on my Alpha Tyrannon a little bit here in the future and stop using my Phoenix to, you know, just travel around. You know, of course, I could continue using my Phoenix to kill stuff, and it looks like we have some Prime Dodos down there. I don't think I really need to kill them. I've got tons of Prime Hide, Prime Blood, and stuff back home. Although, I don't think the Dodos drop uh, Prime Blood. I think they just rarely drop Prime Hide or something like that. I'm not 100% sure. But... Yeah, I think from now on, if I'm just going to be, you know, going from my new base to my old base, uh, I'm definitely going to be using my Alpha Terrain on. Maybe you upgrade his uh, speed a little bit here and there, because, of course, I don't need him as a utility as much anymore, because, of course, we do have this Phoenix nowadays. So, don't really need to use him for anything other than just uh, traveling the map super duper fast. And, of course, he is an Alpha, so he can hold his own against pretty much almost anything that's, uh, you know, decently leveled and not super high tech and everything. <laughs> high level, high tech, everything like that, you know. He, he won't be going up against alpha creators and stuff like that he might he might be able to hold his own against a couple alphas here and there but nothing quite as much as our heckin phoenix right anyways i guess i'm going to pause the recording head back home let's go make let's go make one regular choose a tooth of saddle and then i guess we can go test drive those guys maybe go down to the uh to the area down there past the blue tower over there where we saw so many Nidarius and stuff like that. Let's see if we can actually kill those guys super duper easily. And I guess just generally see how easy it is to kill a bunch of Nidarius, a big pack of Nidarius, with an Alpha Tusa Toothus. So go to Bowser Recorder real quick, make one singular 
to, to the saddle, and I'll see you guys back over there, and I guess we can go test these guys out. So I'll see you guys here in a bit. Alright guys, back. I repaired all my scuba stuff because of course it was almost broken, my tank was almost broken and everything like that. Especially because of how long we've been using it, honestly. Of course the tank does uh, lose durability and because of course that's like it's a little oxygen meter. Anyways, let's put on everything right there, all the scuba stuff, and I even improved the Tusa Toothless saddle to uncommon. Couldn't improve it beyond that because I ran out of hide because of course I've been using tons of hide to make uh, armor reagents and stuff like that. So I had basically no hide, had to get on my mo- uh, not my motosaurus, but <laughs> had to get on my man and actually, what in the world happened? I'm stuck. <laughs> I had to get on my mantis and kill a few critters here and there, of course. Yeah, it's fantastic, uh, like, collection of everything, because, of course, you could actually grab a, uh, a hatchet and actually, you know, what in the world's going on right now? I'm, I'm legitimately stuck. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, I used my mantis to get a bunch of hide and stuff like that, and uh, used all the rest of that to actually improve my tooth -to toothless saddle up to uncommon. And you can see right here, I even maxed it out to 125 armor rating. It had, I believe, 25 armor rating baseline, so that's going to be really good with that extra 100 armor rating right there. Really nice. Anyways, I, I am legitimately stuck right here. I need to probably restart my game or something like that. <laughs> I think if I, like, ghosted because I'm in... Oh, wait, never mind. I thought because I was in water, it wouldn't work, because usually whenever you ghost, what in the world's going on? I still can't move. Hold on, ghost again? There we go, now I can move. What in the world? Okay. Uh, walk? I should unghost. Okay, well, I guess I guess we're fine. <laughs> Anyways, uh, level 69, I believe this was, yes, 91, that 98,000 health right there, sheesh, that is so good. He's gonna have, like, 150,000 health or something crazy here pretty soon, you guys, it's insane, oh my god! Look at how tiny we are compared to the, I, I'm zooming all the way! I am legit, look at that, I am zoomed in all the way, you guys can probably not even see me if you're watching on a phone or something, but that little, I'm gonna zoom in right now, that little orange line right there, that's me, that's my scuba tank. <laughs> And you can see in the background, I actually brought my Alpha Tyranon over here, and, you know, he was actually pretty fast, honestly, so, yeah, I think I'm going to start using him to, uh, you know, traverse the skies uh, at a faster pace and whatnot. Anyways, probably want to put on our night vision goggles. Ah, oh, man, I probably should have repaired those. Eh, not that big of a deal. Ooh, ooh, yeah. Because we are an Alpha, we have this Cheeto dust. That might be kind of a problem here in the future, though, you guys. Let's see. I, I haven't used a Tooth of Toothless in a long time, so... Let's see. How in the world do I attack these fellas here? Uh, let me set everyone at home to passive. I'm trying to attack these guys, but I don't think we're really doing anything. Oh, there you go, 259. Uh, I think I need to turn around. How in the world? Oh, there you go. Turn it around right there with a the right click. Man, yeah, well, yeah, our attacks are really slow. I guess it is only good at uh, killing Nidarius because, of course, they basically just stand still the entire time. <laughs> Let's see, what else do we have around here? Do I have an ink attack? I might have an ink attack where I can ink on command. Hmm. I'm not. Not seeing anything. Not ready to defecate yet. Yeah. Uh. Oh, is that it? Yep, that's the ink attack. Yes. Cool. Awesome. All right. Well, I guess any critters that are inside of that, and I, maybe because I'm a, uh, maybe because I'm a squid, if anything inks on us, maybe we're impervious to it now. I don't know. Anyways, let's try and attack these fellas. And if we do come across like an alpha choose a tooth, this maybe we'll be able to take it on and actually heck and kill it, you guys. That'd be kind of cool. But I'm not really doing anything to these guys. Seems like they're just running. Oh, yeah, 518 damage right there. Man, yeah, oh, 500. Yeah, yeah, pretty decent amount of damage. But these guys can run away a lot faster than I get to attack them. Sheesh. <laughs> oh, Megalodon. Not seeing anything else around here. There you guys. Whoa, another alpha right there, though. Man. Okay, let's, let's try and let's try and kill. Can we kill that alpha? I don't know what level that is. And I, of course, I do not have an. Oh, Steelicans just got murdered. <laughs> Look at all those 518s right there. Those are attacks. Those are AoE attacks. I must be hitting multiple critters at a time right now, which is good. I always keep going this way. Turn us around a little bit right here. I don't know if we're doing any damage to the actual alpha right there, but we might be impervious to getting, uh, to getting grabbed, to getting snatched, if you will. <laughs> Look at all those green numbers. Man, we're doing a lot of damage to a lot of critters. Not complaining. Man, and there's even a plesiosaur coming, too. Man, look at all those yellow numbers, too. Yeah, we're taking a lot of damage as well as dealing a lot of damage. Man, okay, we just killed a Tusa Toothless right there. That's good. And we picked up some black pearls. That's awesome. That's awesome. And we just killed a Megalodon. And, oh, no, we got inked. No, man, I thought we were impervious to that. No, man. All right, let's do a little bit of uh, melee damage. Shoot 66. Oh, man, it goes up by, like, 11% per... Whoa, look at all those level ups. Oh, my God, 100,000 health. I didn't even see those level ups, you guys. That's probably from killing the Tooth of Toothless. We get so many level ups. It's crazy. 487, 487. Man, we're getting hits over here. We're getting hit hardcore by a bunch of critters. Man, Tooth of Toothless down. Seeing a lot of ink down there, as well as my, uh, 
white cloud from being an alpha. So man, that's just a big old mess down there. 975 damage. I don't know if we're killing the alpha. I can't see it all because look at all that damage we're doing. We're only taking like double digit damage right now, but and there's a significant chunk out of our health if you guys look at the top right. Man, <laughs> let's keep on attacking these fellas. I don't think we're attacking all of them though. Let's try and get them. There you go. Kill that Tusa Toothus. I think, yep, that's the alpha there in the background. Looks like he ran away. He might have been low on health or something. Definitely need to watch out on that. Anyways, let's try and get that alpha. Try and swim up towards him. Turn us around. There we go. And not getting... Oh, there you go. 37 health. 37 damage. 975. Seems like we're doing minimal damage to this fella. Of course I can. Super spyglass him and see how much damage he actually... Or uh, how much health he has. Taking a little bit of damage from this plesiosaur. And look at that. 975 damage. Turn us around again. Oh, another alpha in the background. Another alpha in the background. Definitely need to watch out here, you guys. 487, 487, etc, etc. Man, there's so many critters. There's so many critters. It's insane. We're dealing damage. We're taking damage. Oh my god. Once again, a big cluster of death right here. Two Alpha Tusatuthus against me. One singular Alpha Tusatuthus. I'm surprised we're even still alive right now. We have so much health. 100,000 plus. Oh my god. We have any oh, another Tusatuthus down. All right, that's good. Let's give ourselves some level 51. Oh my god. So many levels to give us uh, more health. 200,000 health. I don't even care. More melee damage. Let's go to like a thousand percent if we can. Oh my god. Man, I'm looking at the top right, but I was about to say like we're almost dead. But yeah, that's because we basically doubled our health right there, you guys. Man. Keep on spinning around, I guess. That way we'll be able to hit multiple critters at once. And hopefully we'll be able to eat a bunch of uh, regular raw food. Yes, two more Tusa Toothus down. That's good. I I'm liking this little spin attack. 1700 damage per hit. Oh my god. Holy, oh my god, that is insane! Man! Looks like another Tusa Tusa Santa Plesius were down. Looks like we're free. We're able to move now, you guys. That's good. Now, there's one alpha. There's one singular alpha. Can we take this guy out? 1700. Oh my god, look at those multiple 1700 health or uh, 1700 damage right there we're doing. Sheesh! 576, 576, 576. Yep, yeah, looks like the two alphas here are still alive. All of its little minions that soaked up all the damage. They're down and out for the count. We're regaining health. Look at that on the top right. We're all, we're at like past half health right now. We're regaining that 200,000. Oh my god. More and more level ups. This is just crazy, you guys. Might want to get uh, more movement speed or something here. Uh, carry away movement speed. That's actually pretty decent right there, you guys. You gotta admit, sheesh. <laughs> Let's keep spinning around. That way we keep on uh, taking advantage of this AoE damage we're doing. And I have a level up for myself, probably multiple, honestly. So I definitely need to remember, hey, give myself some level ups. Go over like 400 health or whatever right now. Man, another Tusa Tooth is down. That's good. I believe we're just, just randomly just... Oh, another one down. I think... I think we got inked by one of the regular ones. Don't know if that was the alpha that tried to ink us 1,900 damage per hit with AoE. Oh my gosh. We're doing such crazy. Oh, what's that down there? Oh, these are the, uh, the kelp things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see if we can pursue this alpha. Take him down. He might be pretty low, especially with those 1,950 damages we were doing just moments ago. There's two alphas. We're circling like sharks. This is crazy. 1,950. So much damage being done here, you guys. It's insane. Can I ink him? I can. That's good. So we can get inked. I assume these guys are inked and they, they can't move. They're, they're basically out of stamina now, I assume. Hopefully we'll be able to take him on here in a second or at least take him out and kill him. Oh, man. Might want to get some more melee damage. Six normal. Oh, my gosh. That's crazy. 250,000. Yep, 245,000 health. Oh, man. That's just awesome. Man. I am surprised these alphas are still. How are they still alive? I think the alpha just inked. I think the alpha just inked. Of course, that is a defensive mechanism. So, I don't know which one it might have been, but there are two of them, so it shouldn't be too hard to try and figure out which one it is. Just attack either one of them with these 1950 damages. Sheesh. Man, and there's another one there behind me. I can't even see. Like, there's so much alpha dust around here in the, <laughs> in the water. I can't see. Everything's just glowing like white with all the alpha dust. Of course, it would be like orange if I didn't have my knife and goggles on, but look at all that 975 we're doing. Man, super spy glass? Can we super... I can't super... Oh my god, no! We can't use super spy glass. Man! But look at all this 1950 we're doing right here, though. Sheesh. Oh my god, he's he's pretty bloody. He's pretty... Yes, that's the alpha that just did the, uh, the, 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 the ink. Jeez, I can't speak English right now. I'm... I'm oh! 
No, that's just a red or two. Oh, man, we didn't kill the alpha just yet. There's the alpha there in the background. I wonder if we have an ink jet or like a jetting ability that will like launch us. Because, of course, I believe regular squid. Oh, my God, is that three? I think we're being pursued by three alphas now. This is just stupid. <laughs> oh, my God. Come on, kill him. Come on. Tangle him up. Tangle him up. Tangle him up with all the tentacles. Hashtag tentacle tango. <laughs> tentacle tango, right? Jeez, we're dancing with all of our tentacles. Oh my god, everything's like white right now. Might be able to... Oh man. How have we not killed a single one of these guys yet? Sheesh, that's what I want to know. <laughs> oh my god. We do have a lot of levels right now, I believe. But man, we're at like quarter million health. Don't think we need to worry. Yep, another two to two this down. Look at all that green! Of course, there's a little bit of double-digit yellow that we're taking, but man, we're doing a lot of green damage there, though. Sheesh! There you go. Ink Cloud is gone. That's good. Killing more and more critters. We might be able to max this guy out on levels here very, very soon. Very easily. It's going to be insane, you guys. Come on! Okay, I might want to take my... Can I take him off? There you go. Take that off. Uh, yeah, I'm like, it is still pretty dark right now. But at least everything isn't completely blown out in white because of the, uh, the alpha cloud, I guess you could call it. So let's see if we'll be able to take these guys on. There you go, 653 damage. Definitely want to see, I'm pretty sure that one that was almost dead, he probably healed up all the way. Yeah, that's him back there. Yeah, I'm not seeing any blood on him, you guys. Mmm, just killed a regular piece of tooth right there, but I'm going to continue attacking just blindly. <laughs> Seven more level ups, let's do some more melee damage up to 11, oh. 1074 are still pretty dang on good. No! Whoa, that's still regular one. Okay, that was not the alpha. Come on, kill the alpha. Why can I not kill him? Man, 10. Oh, man, look at all that damage. Sheesh, look at all that green. Oh, man. I'm just kind of killing these guys hardcore, but they're not dead. How are none of these guys dead yet? That's what I want to know, man. Come on. There's three alphas. We're fighting three alphas. We have a quarter million health. Oh, we just got inked. Surely someone's about to die. Come on. Yeah! One alpha down! Only two to go! Come on. And the ink is gone. That's good. The ink effect, at least. There's still a big cloud of black ink. 2,000 damage per hit with AoE. Multiple damage. Oh, my God. Regular Tusa Tooth is down. His little minions are not going to save him now. We have two more alphas. I don't know where they are. Man, we have like no... Oh, more level ups. Sheesh. More melee damage. Don't mind if I do. Sheesh. I want to get our uh, get rid of all this raw stuff. Don't want that trash. Oh, we're getting attacked by something. Can't really see what it is, but we're doing 2178 damage. Oh my gosh. Sheesh. Okay, looks like we're fighting a uh, another alpha. That's a regular Tusa Tooth that we just killed. Hopefully, we'll be able to get this right... Or, uh, this alpha. Oh, man, we just ran out of stamina. No! Eat food, eat food, eat food. Come on! He's not regaining stamina. My, yeah, definitely want to give him some stamina, because, of course, he has only, like, 500 right now. Sheesh. That's nothing. That's nothing. Come on. Ah, oh, we have to go back there. Okay, we're regaining stamina right now, which is good. I don't know where the other one went, but, of course, we had three of them. We just killed one of them. That leaves two to be around here somewhere, and one of them's right here. I don't know. Oh, is that him? I think that might be the other one right there. I'm not 100% sure. Railer Tooth of Tooth has just went down. 2178 damage per hit with all these tentacles. Of course, I think that might be because each tentacle like does a hit on its own. That might be why we do AO, uh, AOE damage. Yeah, look at that. 2178. This guy's got to get pretty soon uh, killed here pretty soon. Sheesh. I can't even speak. <laughs> Come on. Come on, keep getting him. Keep whipping him. I'm, I keep trying to follow him with my tentacles, you know? That way we're hopefully going to do maximum damage, you know? And, oh man, he's still, look at all that green. 2178, 2178, 2178. Surely he's got to start inking here pretty soon, right? Come on, turn around, turn up. No, turn around. Yes, keep doing damage. Keep it on. Keep the offense. Yes, look at all that damage. Man. Come on, keep following him. He's going to ink us here any second. And, come on. Look at all that, though. Man. Come on. Oh, he inked. He inked. He inked! Come on, keep following him. I can barely- I can see a faint little orange glow. Keep taking him on. Yeah! Another one! Whoa! Level 140! Man! We probably got a million- eight more level ups, yeah. Yeah, oh my god, we have 382,000 XP. Oh, man. 300,000 health. You guys want to do that? Maybe get a little bit more health. More melee damage. 
this is just insane. This is just, oh my, oh, yep, there's the other alpha. He came over here, he saw us kill that one, and he's like, yeah, I, I, I've got to try my attempt at this, even though this guy has, like, almost 300,000 health. Man, <laughs> these are not too smart squid, are they? <laughs> uh, I don't think they are. I don't think they're very smart. Oh my god, 2282 damage per thing, per tentacle, I guess I could call it now, instead of just saying damage per hit. Because, of course, each tentacle, I guess does a hit on its own, so that might be why we do the AoE, like I said. Very, very interesting stuff. Now, we need to keep on turning around, that way our uh, tentacles keep getting them. And, come on! I'm just turning around right now, man, I think we might be like really slow right now because of the, uh, is that a regular one? I can't tell. Yeah, that, yeah, that's a regular one, what in the world? Where's the other alpha at? Yeah, there we go, that one's down. I don't know where the other alpha is, we just killed. One of, oh my god, look at all that prime chitin and stuff, man, oh! Did we not get any? Oh man, um, I might want to look around here and see if I can find any bags. Cause we should have Chusatutha's eyes, right? Or something, tentacles or something. I don't know where that one we just killed went. Oh yeah, these giant crystal things? I guess you can mine crystal from them. Uh, oh man, I have no stamina right now. I need to regain stamina, come on. My stamina, okay, my stamina, oh my god, oh, whoa! 13 level ups! What in the world? So we're up to 400 health. Let's get a little bit more stamina, just because of why not, right? Oh my, we have 10 more levels. We can go into 500 health, you guys. Oh my gosh. I might want to do, uh, I don't know what I want to do. <laughs> of course, I could always do a mind wipe tonic if I want. Stamina, I don't really need that to go up, like, at all. Health, that's always a good one. Stay, same with, uh, carry weight. Might want to do health, might want to, yeah, let's do melee damage. Let's do that. 275, that's really good. We can get up to th uh, 300 if we want. Mmm. Yeah, let's do 300. 300% melee damage, oh my gosh. But man, yeah, we're getting a lot of black pearls and stuff. A lot of, uh, tentacles here. Don't really need those. If we already have a bunch back home, we just drop that all out of our inventory. Berries, I don't know what we got that from. Megalodon teeth, of course, Megalodons drop that. Don't need that garbage. Don't need the oil, because of course, we do passively produce oil on our own. As well as our Bathosaurus, as well as our other Alpha fella. So don't really need the oil too much, but, uh, might want to give this guy a little bit more movement speed. He, he seems to get about, what was it, uh... I think it was like 2% per level up, right? Like 2% movement speed, and we gave him like 5 level ups for that, and he's up to 210. So he's moving pretty fast, to be quite honest. I'm not bragging or anything, but man, he's able to kill things super fast. He's able to move decently fast. Can't complain about it one heckin' bit. Man, now can I... Oh, there's a lot of, uh, bags. Oh, yeah. Yeah, a lot of bags here. Two's a two, there's... See if we can actually... Oh, a little bit of black pearls right there. I, of course, it's never a bad idea to grab these. But uh, I guess I can just kind of give them to, there we go, 70 pounds right there. See if any of these are the alpha, none right there. A uh, little bit of black pearls, that's always good. Of course, now we have 500 pounds of carry weight, so we can carry a lot of black pearls without having to get over encumbered, which is great. A uh, little bit of the absorbent substrate stuff, but we only get like one of those per thing, and of course we can craft that at home pretty easily. And if we're missing like one absorbent, of course I think we need that to repair our uh, night vision thing, but it should be pretty easy to craft if we actually need it, you know? But let's go over here. Let's go grab these last What? Oh, wait, there's another bag over there. Yeah, let, let me set this guy to follow me. <laughs> I don't know why he wasn't set to follow me. He just moans go, but man, we just went on an inadvertent Tusa Toothless rampage just seconds ago. I only wanted to, I'm like, I kind of wanted to go on a rampage, but mainly to kill Nidaria. Oh, Alpha Tooth, yes! Okay, so we did get an eye right here. And did he give up? I don't think he gave us Black Pearl. Either that or my guy already picked it up. Yeah, that's probably what happened. And he gave us another flag thing right there. That's probably going to give us a decent amount of uh, metal if we throw it inside of the, the, the grinder. So that's always good. Uh, what about this bag? I don't know if... And it looks like... Is that Blue Tribe? That is Blue Tribe. Hold on. That's got to be Blue Tribe right there. Yeah, Blue Tribe. Blue Tribesmen. Definitely want to watch out for them, you guys. Because, of course, we will take a little bit of a... Where in the world does a bag go? Did we just pass it? Oh man, level 188, sheesh, I think we did, I think we just passed the bag, but of course there are blue tribesmen right there, so let's test out this AoE damage, see if we'll be, is that the alpha there in the background? I think it is, maybe we'll be able to kill the blue tribe here in a moment, and then try and finally kill that alpha, and they're spawning in there what look like Baryonyx, and one Carbonimus, and we're taking on the blue tribe. And we're killing them pretty easily there. Sheesh. I love how we're just harvesting dead human flesh over here like it's nothing. <laughs> oh, man, let's kill these guys. Of course, our turning radius isn't really the best. That is... Is that, a ra is that an alpha? I can't tell if that's an alpha or not. Anyways, yeah, because they're like right next to me. I can't really uh, get any good direct hits on them with my tentacles. 
Yeah, that's a regular one right there. Yeah, that's definitely not the Alpha Tusa Toothus. There you go. Blue Tribe's been down. Another Tusa Toothus down as well. Getting tons of level ups here, you guys. It's crazy. Um, probably the Live Pearls and stuff in our inventory. That's probably weighing us down hardcore. Don't need the Keratin. Definitely want to keep the Prime Keratin slash Chitin. Of course, that only weighs 100 pounds per stack. And yeah, they ate through a little bit of my, uh, my carry weight right there, but nothing insane. But uh, let's try and kill that Megalodon. Where'd he go? Can't really see him. Oh, there it is. Whoa. Yeah, he was like right next to me. Yeah, that's that's the weak spot about us. Is that whenever they're like right up against us, that's when we're the weakest. Because of course we can't attack whenever they're attacking our straight up head. We can only attack things that are really far away. Because of course our tentacles are very, very long. So our super long tentacles are not able to defend our main body area here with our head and whatnot. So that's kind of unfortunate. But we do have level ups for myself. One more. Hmm. Fortitude, don't need to worry about that, like, at all. Um, movement speed, don't need to worry about that. Yeah, I've run into a few problems here and there with, uh, being too hot and stuff, even though I've had decent armor, so might want to get a little bit of fortitude at 22, I think that gives us now. Uh, yes, 22 fortitude. Let's go back to our base. I think it's, like, right around here, right? Let's go back to the base. <laughs> Drop off the- how many- how many black pearls do we have now? This is kind of crazy. 200 and, uh, only 359? I thought we were cut- oh yeah, because our carry weight on this guy isn't really that good. He only has 1,400 pounds of carry weight, so of course, he's not able to carry around hundreds and almost a thousand black pearls like our Mosasaurus was able to earlier on, so definitely want to go drop off some of the stuff, as well as some of the oil, and definitely want to alleviate some of the carry away, but man, <laughs> I, I- like I said, only went around there to kill an Idaria, ended up killing pretty much- I think we confirmed killed two Alpha Tusa Toothus. Probably a dozen, multiple dozen regular Tusa Toothus. And of course, one Alpha Tusa Toothus got away, so that's unfortunate. But got a lot of levels there, though, guys. What level was he? Like 69 before whenever we came out? And now he's level 188. He got well over 100 level ups just by killing a few critters here and there. Man. Uh, oh, I went a little bit too far. Here's the area where we spawned in on the first episode and whatnot. So we definitely need to go this way a little bit more. And I, I really want to say, and because we have such good melee damage, I wonder if, we, you know, if we did kill the Nidarius, we seemingly get only like, what is it, like 17, 18 uh, biotoxin per Nidaria. I wonder if we'll be able to get uh, way more than that now that we have really good melee. Was it like 1100, 1170% melee damage, 272 heckin health, 272,000 health. Sheesh, that's a big uh, little descriptor right there. 272 health would be nothing. I have more than that on myself. I'm not bragging. It's just a fact. <laughs> Jeez. But let's go get, I guess we just resource pull it through the vault because of course that's basically what that vault is for, right? So let's get the uh, the flak armor on just because we're not able to move very fast whenever we have our scuba flippers on. Of course, I could just switch out my what in the world's happening here? Oh, he's killing a tree. Man, these things are still killing critters. For whatever reason. Innocent critters. I'm pretty sure I crow uh crowbrammed. I'm pretty sure I programmed these things a little while ago to not uh kill triceratops and like stegos and stuff like that. Uh where is it at? T for triceratops. Uh well, there it is right there. Yeah, do not kill it. Exclusion. It's still shooting it! No, it's dead, man! Ah. Ah, what are you going to do, though? Sheesh, that the, it seems like it doesn't even care about the exclusions. <laughs> oh, let me put up the prime kite and stuff right there. And let's get all the black barrels off of, I guess, all the critters, honestly. How many black barrels are we going to have here? Uh, 836 black barrels, whoa. Oh, we still have a little bit on our Tooth of Tooth is 299. I guess I can carry that on my person. And what was it? Oh, yeah, squid oil. And boom, there he goes. Let's try and pull the squid oil over here. That's good. It only weighs 20 pounds per uh, stack, but, you know, it, whenever these guys passively produce oil and stuff like that, it will add up over time so don't want to carry too much of that around oh what in the world i'm glitched again what's going on with this hold on ghost and walk there you go i haven't had this like it's happening again what so this is this keeps happening around this area i wonder why she didn't glitched around this area hopefully i don't get glitched on this little ledge okay i'm good okay <laughs> okay let's get back on our alpha tooth tooth it's just what in the world i can't move again what is happening there we go. I don't know what's going on with this. Maybe I keep on clipping into in, like invisible barriers or something like that. I don't know what's going on with that. But anyways, um, oh, I guess it. Okay, it must be the level sixty-five Tusa Toothus over here that had the. Uh, I think it was the black pearls, not the oil, because I think he might be a little bit too far away from the uh, the vault to be able. To, yeah, there you go. Let's put it on the Mosasaurus. There we go. Mosasaurus should be a little bit closer to the uh, to the beach or to the shore or whatever to the black to the to the vault. Sheesh. Can't speak English. <laughs> oh, 
Uh, anyways, let's go back to the bowl and let's go drop this off. And I guess we can go hopefully find some Nidaria and actually see if we get more uh, Biotoxin by killing them with... Oh, I wasn't even... Yeah, I wasn't wearing the... Oh my god, I'm glitched again! Man! There we go. I'm gonna have to restart my game or something. Because it seems like whenever I glitch and stuff like that, and then I do the ghost thing, it just seems to get worse. So I might want to restart my game, but real quick, let's drop off the rest of the Black Pearls. And there's 299, and that's 200, 400, 600, 800, 1,000, 1,135 Black Pearls. And probably more back home that I forgot to bring over here, so sheesh. We have way more Black Pearls than we need. Although, it's still nothing when you compare to how many Black Pearls we have in Apparition, right? It's just crazy. Anyways, I guess I'm going to restart my game real quick, and I'll see you guys here in a bit, and I'm going to head out that direction where we were a couple episodes ago whenever we uh, were trying to kill Nidarius, and there were a bunch of them all over the place. Let's go see how well the Alpha Tusatuthis is at killing and harvesting biotoxins from Nidarius. So, go to pause the recording real quick, and I'll see you guys here in a bit. Mm -hmm.